good morning, everybody. Um, might not be morning when I post this, but you never know. It is currently quarter to eight in the morning, and I've just collected a little snake from the Aralone Golf Course. Absolutely beautiful spot. Um, so I'm now releasing this little snake out here. It was not what I was expecting. Um, this is a Parasuta nigriceps, commonly known as a blackback snake, or also known as a Mitchell's short-tailed snake. Um, not that you can see it very well through there. They thought it was a Jew guy. Um, it was raising its head, getting very defensive. Typical little Jew guy. Not quite baby Jew guy season yet, so didn't think it was going to be one of those, but it wasn't expecting one of these. Very uncommon to find these guys. Um, in all the years of driving around looking for them, I've only found three. Two of them were a couple of weeks ago. And they're a mildly venomous snake. Um, very mildly venomous. Uh, this is about as f big as they'll get. Um, they tend to eat other small lizards, geckos, possibly reptile eggs, um, and stuff like that. Um, fun fact, I was bitten by one of these a couple of weeks ago when I found them. Found two, photographed them. Um, the live one was a little bit feisty. Um, and as I was trying to calm it down, it got me on the finger. It hurt for a couple of weeks. Um, not that I recommend it, but it was interesting to see the effects of a mildly venomous snake. Uh, the second one we found was dead, so it was kind of much easier to photograph. Anyway, um, this guy was actually really quite feisty. Um, as I said, was raising its head up at people. And um, when I found it, it was not shy about biting. Um, it had some cobwebs on its head, so I was trying to pin its head to get all the cobwebs off it. And it was biting the hook, it was biting trying to bite the tub that it was in, tried to bite me a few times, pooed on me, that was pleasant, 7 o'clock in the morning getting pooed on by a snake, um, so because not many people get to see this guy, I'm gonna, trying to get out that little hole, what a clown, uh, because not many people get to see these things, I would have even heard of them, um, thought I'd do a little video on this guy's release, see what kind of behaviour he's going to come up with. Um, so yeah, he'll probably take off anyway, but we'll see how we go. Now you get to see just how pretty these snakes are. They are absolutely stunning. One of my favourite ones to find. Come around here and get some footage of his face. You see that defensive posture there? <laughs> he's, he's got a lot of attitude for a little dude. <laughs> launching himself at me. I actually find this quite adorable, to be perfectly honest. Still coming at me. Dude. I really want him to go the other way. <laughs> There's a couple of cyclists coming past. Don't worry about them. But now he's found his way up into the bush. See the leaves moving. Hopefully he'll just hide in there for the rest of the day. Alright, well, I better end it there. We have a display out at 2J today, so I'm going to head off out there. Hope you enjoyed that little video. Um, I don't even get you guys doing that sometimes. Pretty funny to see, but uh, there you go. The Parasuta nigriceps, the black-backed snake, or Mitchell's short-tailed snake. Keep an eye out for them on the roads when you're driving around Canning Dam, Jaradale at night in a country like this. Absolutely beautiful.